That's right, I was in a Mr. Beast video, but it's not really what you think. This video wasn't exactly a last to leave challenge or ages one to 100 or something like that. It all started back in December, 2021. You may have heard of a channel called Mr. Beast Gaming. Yep, that's right, I was on that channel. So back in COVID, this channel was very popular for Mr. Beast because he couldn't really do in real life content. So what he would do is basically do challenges in Minecraft. So luckily I had the opportunity to be involved in one of them. So after Mr. Beast posted his first uh, video on that gaming channel, he had a Discord link in the description and he said, if you join here and do all this, you have an opportunity of being in a video. And that's exactly what I did. I was a big fan of Mr. Beast, so I went in that Discord and I wanted to be on like some other ones, like maybe like in a four corners challenge because that would have been like fun, but that never happened. And eventually I was losing hope. But one day I got a notification on my Discord and I looked and it was from the Mr. Beast gaming server. So basically this notification was a ping to let us know what server to join for Mr. Beast challenge. So I joined the server and they had us waiting around for like about an hour or two hours. I don't remember exactly the time. But during this time period, there was like a lot of mods in the uh, server. Like I know you might know like the first winner, uh, Boy Jedi. He was on the gaming channel. So he was like there, I believe. And there are people um, just like one of the Mr. Beast mods, like they're just building around doing like, they had like the Simon Says thing. And if you look in the background of one of the screenshots I took, they had like this parkour course. They're just building like a bunch of stuff for us just to make it easier for us to wait for the actual challenge to happen. But yeah, the video I was in was like the one called the world's hardest challenge, something like that. I think it might have like changed the name a bit or like the thumbnail because when I looked at it the first time, it's not exactly the same how it was before, but I know Mr. Beast usually like changes his thumbnails around and title to adjust it. So back in this waiting room, I was getting like so excited. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm about to win thousands of dollars. I even told my dad, yo dad, I'm in the Mr. Beast video. I'm about to be in a Mr. Beast video. And he was actually so proud of me. And so one of the, a few, like one of the main, like usually you know how like they have like at this time, Minecraft YouTubers in the challenges. So one of the people they invited was actually Fundy. So I have some screenies with him. Um, yeah. And I think he was, yeah, he was pretty much the only one they invited, so there was no like dream or anything, but honestly, I think that's for the best. <laughs> but he was more popular back then. Um, so right before the challenge was starting, I remember there's like a big countdown to get to it, and I was getting like so nervous. So when the challenge is about to finally start, they teleport us to like the first area, and this is like where you could see where it was in the video. I have a screenshot here, and here I had the opportunity to see uh, Chandler and Carl, I think I have some screenshots with them. Maybe Chris, I don't remember, but that was like a, I was like so, it was like so excited to see them. Oh yeah, and also the main one I have like is with Mr. Beast, obviously. So as you all know from the video, if you saw it, the first level was a parkour level, and honestly, it was pretty easy until the very last jump I made. Yep, that's right. I was at the parkour, and then there's this one part at the end with ice, and everything was going easy so far. And if you messed up, you're able to like climb back up. But there's this one jump I missed towards the end with the ice and I fell in the lava. And I'm pretty sure that was like one of the only parkour parts of the video. So it was a bit upsetting for me, but it was a fun experience. At the end of the day, I walked away with, um, I think it was absolutely nothing. Yeah, they don't really give any compensation on the Mr. Beast gaming channel as they do in uh, the actual Mr. Beast channel. So it is what it is. I mean, I had a fun time in Minecraft doing whatever it was in the pre-lobby and I got to take some screenshots with other people, but this is the first time I'm like sharing the story. It's just like, I've, honestly, I kind of forgot about it until, <laughs> cause it wasn't like that big of a deal for me since I didn't really get anything out of it. I, I remember it, I was part of it, but I, I just thought I'd share it now. So that's it for me, but please make sure you subscribe because as I'm recording this video, I am three subscribers away from 500 and I got something really big planned. All right, thanks again. Bye. Hey.